Fiji against the New Zealand. Good crowd support, emotions running high and uh, dreams of making it to Peru to the FIFA Under-17 World Cup. New Zealand had the first say in this one. Martin Bullock urging his side on. Adam Watson made it count seven minutes into the game. Good work in the Fiji penalty box and then lined it up, left foot shot. Adam Watson, first of three goals in this semi-final. New Zealand up 1-0 after seven minutes. And then Fiji worked a set-piece move from the free kick. Shankar, Aaron Niker and Salomone Ravonokula crashing a first-time shot from this cross from Niker into the bar, into the goal. One all at halftime. So Adam Watson got the second goal for New Zealand. That was five minutes into the second half. Two goals to one. Adam Watson, class in the finish. New Zealand produced opportunities in the second half. They were the team in the second half. They shifted the gear. And then 27th minute, Luke Suppick made it three goals to one. Great work, Luke Sapek. Six goals in the championship. And then eight minutes later, if Fiji had any chance of coming back, Adam Watson finishing off. Great work. That was a right foot shot. Hat trick for Adam Watson. And New Zealand make it to the final, beating Fiji. Well, who would have thought that uh, Vanuatu would come out firing the way they did? And New Zealand, so much passion and pride from both teams at the beginning of this. Football pundits had Vanuatu as underdogs and New Zealand as favourites. And New Zealand, with early pressure, hit the post. But Vanuatu survived somehow. And Martin Bullock and his New Zealand side then saw Vanuatu come back and string some good play. Some great first half action. Luke Sapek with a brilliant shot. And Joseph Nako. Time and again made some good uh, saves. Watson got that into the net, but uh, from an offside position. And New Zealand, opportunity after opportunity. De Villiers that time. Romain Luek dancing amongst the defenders of New Zealand. Couldn't connect with the shot. At the end of that, but opportunities for Vanuatu, opportunities for New Zealand, they couldn't find the goal, and this is where Jan Chilia got the red card. 
a little bit too harsh maybe you can uh, certainly dispute that but that was in the 13th minute of sec the second half and 10 men Vanuatu then absorbed tons of pressure and uh, that time Nako again standing tall ahead of Luke Sepik Vanuatu making the break Luik overrunning that and that's the support for Vanuatu. And this is where Nakoa went across to make the challenge. Luke Sapik. 91st minute of play. The only goal in the game. For New Zealand from the penalty spot. To the delight of the Kiwi fans.